When you hear the engine of a powered parachute, you feel the roller coaster adrenaline rush as you brace yourself for takeoff. Before you realize it, you are already in the air. High in the sky, the view is remarkable, as though you are a bird in the sky. From the two aircrafts, the Interceptor has a kite for a wing, and the Airwolf, also known as the Enforcer, has a parachute for a wing. Extremely easy and very efficient. Both vehicles run on car gas. They operate anywhere from $20 to $40 an hour. Your helicopter is about $1,500 an hour. They are something else. It's like he says, in, in the one, you can lose an engine and glide from now on. The powered parachutes are capable of flying up to 10,000 feet, and they cover a lot of territory when they're up that high. But they also discover a few things that could be very beneficial to our law enforcement. Uh, of course, Border Patrol. We've flown quite a few uh, uh, missions for the border and have had quite a few successes. Setting up takes just under two minutes. A few local authorities have started using powered parachutes due to their low cost benefits. One powered parachute ranges from $30,000 to $90,000, as opposed to a helicopter costing over a million dollars, a huge advantage of what can be sighted from the sky. I don't know if you noticed what they were doing, but they had the trunks open. So what they had done is they unloaded the bales and they had them underneath those rocks. The Border Patrol calls that rocking. I'm Danny Jimenez, JMC 330. So. Okay.